folks, first of all, let me say one thing. Goomba is not uh, involved with the mob. I'm not saying he doesn't have a couple of trucks. But, uh, folks, in my early days as the dad fan of the Irish, I too caught hate for making fun of my own people. <laughs> Tell us one awful truth about your ethnicity. Start with, Gum Start with Gumba. You know, Colin, the awful truth about being Italian is that we never, ever want to leave our mother for another woman. Another woman will never cook like my mother. I will never trust another woman like my mother. I will never love another woman like my mother. I will stay home in my room that I was born in until the last minute possible. So ladies, if you're dating an Italian man, here's some advice. Shut up, take your clothes off, and turn on a Yankee game. <laughs> Oh. Patrice O'Neal. <laughs> Look, every black person has a very good white friend that we keep tucked away somewhere. <laughs> and that person always asks, why haven't I met any of your other friends yet? <laughs> well, why you think, only white friend? I gotta go back home. <laughs> And when we wear sports jerseys, we don't really necessarily like that team that we're wearing. It's just that the colors go nicely with my rims. And, <laughs> and we all think OJ did it. But you know how much an OJ Simpson throwback is? It's off the hook. So that's why. All right, thank you. You mean, well. let's see if we can get through this without heckling this poor see? kid. You want to know this? Doc Ben. And do it without doing your mama's Vietnamese voice. All right. She's right. Do it as your dad. Do it. Do it. Do it, do it. Do it. Do it. No. as dad. Do it. Man. But do like a German accent. Introducing Dad. Like like do All right. Do it like a French accent in there. No, no. Do a French accent. Come on. It'll be better. Do it. Do it as Miss Saigon. <laughs> you want to do it? Prove to these guys you got the chops. Don't worry. Do it. It'll work. You want to know the awful truth about Asians? Go to any casino anywhere in the United States, and all the conservative Asians that you see at the dry cleaners and liquor stores and nail salons are standing at the tables, the crap tables, and pie guy tables and they're like, ho ho ho, that's it, we gambled our house. <laughs> Here we go. We win. <laughs> My son no go to UCLA. He <laughs> said he go to Compton Community College. <laughs> where we will serve French fries for my son. <laughs> Oh, last night we lost five hundred dollars, <laughs> but that won't happen again until tomorrow night. Yes! Oh, good. Oh, nice. All right. Let's do it. That was nice. And you know, even though it was French, it was a little bit almost like a martial arts. <laughs> I see. That was a good one, boss. Here are some of the things people don't know about Jews. We don't run the country. There are only three and a half percent of us in the U.S. The wasps run the show. Huh. Jewish doctors and scientists have cured more diseases in this world than anyone else. We have won more Nobel Prizes for medicine than anyone else. We have won more Nobel Peace Prizes than anyone else. Also, we helped start and finance the NAACP and marched right alongside the Negroes during the 60s. Yeah. Most of all, God likes us the best and we run Hollywood. Now, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, stop. Let him applaud. Let him applaud. Applaud. Wait, how about the fact that until we fix it, you spelled Nobel, N-O-B-L-E, Nobel, you stupid idiot. <laughs> you are the only Listen. dumb Jew I've ever met today. Yeah, I never said, no, he's, he's first not of all, he's not I never done. said I won one of those prizes. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I well, guess that's a show. It was a big applause. <laughs> hey, it was a big applause. You want applause or laugh? Yeah. Yeah.